everyone, my name is Natalie and I'm a librarian at our Souk branch of Vancouver Island Regional Library. And today we are doing our um, baby time and this one's a little bit special and it's um, all about bugs and insects. Now not all of our songs are about bugs and insects but um, probably half or so are and uh, I thought that would be a really nice springtime theme because of course we're seeing lots more critters outside and maybe your little ones are learning and exploring, maybe touching them, uh, hopefully very gently or um, maybe um, just staring or asking questions depending on their age. So we'll get started with my little friend Teddy is going to be my baby today. So for the songs, um, when I'm putting uh, the teddy in my lap, you can put your baby or toddler in your lap if they're comfortable doing that. Otherwise, you can rock them or um, just sing to them if they're sitting nearby. All right, we're going to wave our hands and start with our welcome song. It is time to say hello to all my friends. It is time to say hello to all my friends. It is time to say hello, give a smile, wink an eye. It is time to say hello to all my friends. Good, so we're gonna start with a lap bounce and now this one isn't about bugs or insects, but um, we're going to just gently bounce baby on our lap and this is all about um, being clean and soap. So it's a nice one to bring out during bath time. Oh, I wish I was a little bar of soap, bar of soap. Oh, I wish I were a little bar of soap, bar of soap. Oh, I slippy and I slidey over everybody's hidey. Oh, I wish I was a little bar of soap, bar of soap. And we'll do that one one more time, ready? Oh, I wish I were a little bar of soap, bar of soap. Oh, I wish I were a little bar of soap, bar of soap. Oh, I slippy and I slidey over everybody's hidey. Oh, I wish I were a little bar of soap, bar of soap. Good. And again, our next one isn't bug themed, but um, it's a pretty fun lap band. So we're going to do it three different ways. We'll do regular speed, fast paced, and then a slow one. Bumpity, bumpity goes the dump truck. Bumpity, bumpity goes the dump truck. Bumpity, bumpity goes the dump truck. Dump out all the load. And you just tip baby to the side at the end. All right, we're gonna do it one more time. And this time it's gonna be pretty fast. And of course you can go whatever speed your baby is most comfortable at. Ready? Bumpity bumpity goes the dump truck. Bumpity bumpity goes the dump truck. Bumpity bumpity goes the dump truck. Dump out all the load. <laughs> Good. All right, and so you can tip baby to the side, or you can do a pothole in the middle with your legs. And this one, we're uh, our next one, our last one. We're going to go pretty slow. Bumpity bumpity goes the dump truck. Bumpity bumpity goes the dump truck. Bumpity, bumpity goes the dump truck. Dump out all the load. Good, all right. And this one is a nice one to sing at breakfast time or if you're making food and it's called I'm Toast in the Toaster. I'm toast in the toaster and I'm getting very hot. Tick tock, tick tock, up by pop and you can give them a nice little tickle when they go up in the sky we'll do that one one more time as well i'm toast in the toaster and i'm getting very hot tick tock tick tock up by pop good and give them a nice little tickle all right now this one is a new song to me but i figured because we're talking about bugs and insects we should sing it and it's called three hungry ants and i'm just gonna look at my words for this one three hungry ants marching in a line they came upon a picnic where they could dine they march into the salad they march into the cake they march into the pepper uh-oh that was a mistake We'll count down to two. Two hungry ants marching in a line. They came upon a picnic where they could dine. They march into the salad. They march into the cake. They march into the pepper. Uh-oh, that was a mistake. Achoo! Make sure to cover your, your mouth with your elbow. And we'll go down to one ant. One hungry ant 
marching in a line, they came upon a picnic where they could dine. They march into the salad, they march into the cake, they march into the pepper. Oh, what's gonna happen? That was a mistake. Oh, chew! And cover your mouth up, chew! Good. And you can repeat that one or add different um, types of food that they're marching into as well. All right, so this one is nice if you put your baby on your lap or if they're lying down and you can make the motions to them or you can have them on your lap and um, bounce along. So this one is all about butterflies and of course I'm going to flap my hands just like a butterfly like this. Flutter, flutter, butterfly floating in the spring sky floating by for all to see floating by so merrily flutter flutter butterfly floating in the spring sky and we'll do that one one more time again you can put them on your lap if you'd like you can even try to move their hands like this so it's flutter flutter butterfly floating in the spring sky floating by for all to see floating by so merrily flutter flutter butterfly floating in the spring sky and you can change the words to all the different seasons so we did spring today because we're in springtime but you could do summer or winter or fall and um, maybe repeat it four times and do all four seasons as well all right now this one is a little bit of a silly one. It's a finger play and a tickle. So if your baby's comfortable, you can um, prop them up and then move along their body as we go through the song. And it's on my foot, there is a flea. On my foot, there is a flea. Now he's climbing up on me. Past my belly, past my nose on my head where my hair grows on my head there is a flea now he's climbing down on me past my belly past my knee on my foot take that you flea and we'll do that one one more time on my foot there is a flea now he is climbing up on me past my belly, past my nose, up on my head where my hair grows. On my head there is a flea, now he's climbing down on me. Past my belly, you can give them a nice little tickle, past my knee, and on my foot. Take that, you flea. <laughs> All right. And another fly themed one is a fly is on my toe. So this is really nice and it's also a nice early literacy tip as well. Um, if you incorporate different um, body parts into your songs, that helps your baby and little one become more familiar with uh, their own body parts as well as your own body parts. And having that um, memory of the song will help them have nice um, bonding experiences with the um, song and the body parts as well. All right. A fly is on my toe, a fly is on my toe. Hi ho, just watch me blow, a fly is on my toe. All right, where's the fly gonna go next? I think on my knee. A fly is on my knee, a fly is on me knee. Hi ho, just watch me blow, a fly is on my knee. Hmm, what about our fingers? A fly is on my finger, a fly is on my finger. Hi ho, just watch me blow, a fly is on my finger. And I think we'll do our nose next, right here. A fly is on my nose, a fly is on my nose. Hi ho, just watch me blow, a fly is on my nose. And we'll do our ears, our ears. A fly is on my ear, a fly is on my ear. Hi ho, just watch me blow, a fly is on my ear. And we'll do last one is our head. A fly is on my head, a fly is on my head. Hi ho, just watch me blow, a fly is on my head. Good, all right. And I have 
a little um, finger play for us, or sorry, a felt story. So I'm just going to set Teddy off to the side for this one. And you can make um, felts at home if you would like, or you can cut them out of paper or just draw, um, or you can just use your fingers to um, make the movement. So this one, the first one I'm seeing is kind of nice because you can just use two fingers and wiggle your fingers rather than having um, little birds. But these are my little love birds and they're great for Valentine's Day as well. Two little lovebirds up on a cloud. One named Soft and one named Loud. Fly away soft, fly away loud. Come back soft, come back loud. Mwah. All right, so you can do um, this again with fingers if you'd like. And this one is about Jack and Jill. Two little lovebirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and one named Jill. Fly away, Jack. Fly away, Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. There you go. So again, you could do two little fingers, uh, two little lovebirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and one named Jill. Fly away, Jack. Fly away, Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. Mwah! Because they're little lovebirds. <laughs> All right, so it's already time for our goodbye song. We're going to wave our hands and I'll bring Teddy back for this one. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. It is time to say goodbye. Give a smile, wink an eye. It is time to say goodbye to all my friends. Good. Thank you guys so much for joining us. One last thing I wanted to do because um, before when we were doing in-person uh, baby times and story times, I loved bringing out my bubbles at the end. And I know lots of little ones are really into bubbles, especially babies, because it's something very shiny and floating in the sky and it looks very strange. Um, so if you get those little tiny packs of bubbles, I encourage you to sing your baby time songs and then blow some bubbles together. It's super fun. So hopefully you can see this through your computer screen.